It's interesting. So, you know, so Carrie's idea was really looking at kind of riffing on the punk houses that existed in Detroit. So, I mean, just like kind of commune style living that was obviously centered around punk music and people who were who were in that scene. So it was a very, as far as like exhibitions are put together, you know, it had this very. He wanted to kind of shoot after this very DIY kind of you know commune aesthetic. So there's works by tons of artists in the show, but Savage Pencil, um, Edwin Pouncey, is who did all of the interior murals here. So he's the kind of main featured artist. And then I mean, there's stuff pulled from a ton of local Detroit artists, obviously a lot of flyers from uh, venues, some still operating, some not, you know, like Seats Coffee House, which is no longer operational, but a bunch of those. So. Working with abstract art is completely different to say drawing uh, something like the wolf or the pig or you know some, some, something with form. You, you're kind of in the dark. And I suppose the piece in the punk house that reflects this is the end wall back there with the black, which Carrie said, can you just do me a wall that it screams don't come down here, you know, keep away, this is dangerous sort of thing. I said, well, I'll have a go. Um, and it ended up being my favourite, my favourite wall, really. I mean, my favourite piece is that down there, because it's basically an abstract painting in black. And, um, mainly because I thought this, this unit here looked like a big monster or something. So I sort of gave it some teeth and stuff like that. And I started off in that corner with felt tip pen and they kind of drooly kind of black curtain for it and then I said what's this look like Karen he said well more more so I just I just he went away and I just started doing it um, but I'm really pleased with the way it's come out and I think you know when you when you at the other end of the corridor it does look kind of foreboding Probably, yeah. <laughs> I think it probably is. But its spirit sort of sort of wriggles on, I don't know. People can't get people can't shake it off, you know what I mean? The the, the punk I know I knew is dead because you know, now it's just a revivalist thing, isn't it? In a way, so sort of. but um, and you sort of see punks going around in London and they kinda of look Kind of wretched, really. They look worse than hippies, really. You know, like old, old hippies. The old punks look even worse. Yeah. 